Hello YouTubers, this is a Toshiba NB100 netbook. This came to me recently and um, as a totally dead um, netbook and I've done various tests to it and um, it's the motherboard. It's not the power supply, it's nothing as simple as the on off switch. Um, definitely the motherboard. Because it's a um, cheaper netbook it's not really worth spending any money to get a replacement motherboard. So um, before I donate it um, to a recycling centre and strip it of any useful bits for myself, I'm going to give it one last um, shot uh, trying to fix it by reflowing the motherboard. Reflowing is a hit or miss affair. Um, there's no guarantee it's going to work. Um, but if you're going to bin uh, a netbook anyway, um, or a laptop or some such, it's worth giving it uh, a try to see if it works. Um, what is reflowing? Well, as the name suggests, um, you melt the solder slightly um, to account for any um, dry joints or circuit breaks. So with that in mind, let's remove the motherboard and strip it of all removable items. Okay, that's the uh, motherboard removed. Um, everything's very dusty. So I'm going to air clean this first before I reflow it. And everything else will be air cleaned before I reassemble everything. Okay, let's reflow this thing. I need to put it in at 196 Celsius. And these lights indicate it's ready to go and the ovens come up to temperature. So that goes in for eight minutes and cools down for an hour afterwards in the oven. And that's a reflowed cleaned up motherboard. Time to refit it.
Okay, it's a bit later and I've reassembled everything. And I've no idea if this is going to work or not. So let's have a look. And no. No LEDs. Screen is dead. No fans. Nothing. So this is uh, beyond repair. So I'm going to strip it for bits and take the carcass to a recycling centre.